everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jessica, and in today's video I will be sharing with y'all stuff that I got from one of the influencer events that I go to every year, um, a bunch of different goodies and things like that. If you enjoyed today's video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down below if you want to stay tuned, stay tuned for more stuff, content. Can I talk today? So when it comes to influencer events, all events are different. Um, if you go to like a fashion event, typically they'll have clothing and different things like that. If you go to a beauty event, they're going to give you their products and beauty products. Um, this event that I went to recently is called Mashup LA and I go to this event every year. It's one of my more favorite events because people are pretty down to earth there um, as opposed to when you go to fashion events. Um, people think that beauty influencers are rude, but to be honest, the fashion bloggers are extremely rude. Normally they'll be like less than 10 people there that are really, really nice. Um, and I typically try to find those people and just hang out with them and enjoy their company. Hold on, there's another airplane. But this event is one of my favorites because one of my friends, Lindsay, puts it on. She does such a great job with all of the events. She does like a VidCon event. She does different events for like different influencer apps and stuff like that. And this one she does every year. My very first influencer event was actually this event. And I was so lost and so lonely. I was there by myself and I looked like a fish out of water. And at that event, that's when I met Liza Koshi. Um, she's a... If you don't know who she is, you should just Google her name because she's like all over the place now. Um, but this was years ago and she's just so amazingly nice. And so I just really like going to this event because people are really nice here for the most part. Majority of them are, which is a rare thing. This is Los Angeles. We've got a lot of different kinds of people around here. So let me get started. I'll get this out of the way because it's on this table next to me. This is Jug... Anato. So at this event there's like a bunch of different booths and you can go up to them and like talk to them and network with them and then there's like alcohol and like a lounging area and music so there's like a lot of fun stuff to do. It's kind of like a little festival. My husband compared it to trick-or-treating for influencers which is kind of funny. Um, not all events are like that but some are. Th these are really cool. This is called Jaganato. We got two of these. We got a tequila and a vodka and they have like games like a bunch of different so they they just come with a bunch of different games some have darts some have like twister i don't even know what this one has so this comes with your bottle of tequila and then it comes with a game what game so every box is different i need to get some scissors so during the event this brand had like a little booth and they give out like shots of alcohol and whatnot, and they'd show you their games and stuff, so that was really cool. There are a bunch of other like popular drinks. I don't have them with me because I drank them at the event, but like Suja, if you're familiar with cold pressed juices, there was like a coffee brand, there was a whiskey brand. Um, I didn't, I only had a Suja, but um, my husband tried like the whiskey and all the other stuff. Oh, I don't know what kind of game this is, but maybe y'all do. It has like dice in a little cup, and then little shot glasses. I don't know what game that is, but um, there's directions like it comes with, so you can figure it out. Sorry if I seem like I'm rushing everyone. I had too much coffee. I have an appointment in 45 minutes to get my nails done, and I have a lot of stuff to go through, so let's just keep going. Next up, I got one of these cute little bags. It says Hask on it, which is the hair brand they have like different booths that do stuff. So this one like put a little zigzag design in my hair. Um, I actually didn't do my hair for the event, which is rare. And so I just kind of was like, do whatever you want. They have like a place where you can get your nails done. They have massages. They have um, like oxygen facials, which are actually very, very cool. I really like those. Um, other alcohol brands, they have like this one brand, it's like tequila, I think, and they have all these cool flavors. I don't have it with me, of course, but um, Hask gave us like a million things, which was so amazing because I'm going on a trip and I need travel stuff. So because I went with my husband, I got double of everything that I'd normally get. Um, so I have like little shampoos and conditioners. I actually used this brand already, so that was really nice because I know that they're great anyway. Um, they gave us a bunch of these. Um, they're like little travel hair masks and they gave us a bunch of boxes of these so these are the boxes of travel masks but then the bag also had travel masks so like when you stop at each one they give you like a bunch of stuff 
Um, this bag literally just has a ton of different hair products. Like I literally have so many of these little hair products from Hask. I think you can get them at CVS, but I want to say maybe I got them at Sprouts in the past, like when I used them when I lived in Texas. Um, so yeah, they basically gave us like hundreds of these little things. I'm pulling these all out of this bag. So I have about 15 of these like travel things now. Perfect timing, thank you, Hask. Um, Bliss is always a sponsor for my friends' events. So Bliss always gives like this big bag of stuff and they hand out like little things as well. I always use these. So these are for my upcoming trip. They're like little bitty and adorable. Up next, we have the big bag from Bliss. And when you walk in, they hand you this bag and this bag already has like really cool stuff in it. But then like as you get stuff from other brands, you can put them in the bag, which is nice. Um, and also you don't like walk around with this giant bottle of alcohol the whole night. Like you can go back at the end and get it. Like you usually don't walk around with the bigger items just yet. Just like when you're ready to leave, you grab them. So um, this was lovely. Um, by the way, their alcohol actually does taste good. It's not like cheap crappy alcohol and then you have a game. Like it's actually good. We tried the vodka um, when we were there. I got these and it's Zaffy Taffy clean teeth taffy this came in my bag and I'm not a taffy person but this is amazing because I don't like um laffy taffy I don't like really sticky stuff I don't know what's in this it's like sugar free gluten free dairy free everything free and it just tastes really good I mean I guess it helps with your teeth getting them clean which is cool and all but it just tastes good and I love candy so um, I've already eaten half of this bag so there's that up next we had this brand, it's called like Rail, R-A-E-L. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. They gave out like a hundred million face masks things. So these were in our little bags. They're like all sheet masks, which is really awesome. But then at the event, they had it set up to where there's like all these different rooms and areas you can explore. And one of them, they had a bathroom and it's like all organic women products so they had like period products and all kinds of stuff they had like a huge bathtub like it was almost like a bathroom whole set like where you would take photos at and in the bathtub on this set like at the event they had a bathtub full of like tampons and pads which was cool i'm interested in going organic with all that stuff and um the chemical free because there's a lot of junk in that and i've actually been like researching it so it was perfect because they just you can grab 10, you can grab whatever you want from the bathroom or the bathtub. Like if there's products, you can just grab them and take them with you. So um, I got a few things to try, which is great. We got some more of these taffies that I've also eaten more of. They had these seaweed, oops, they had these seaweed snacks um, in the little food area. I'm not a huge fan of seaweed snacks, but my husband grabbed these. I don't know why, like he definitely wouldn't like these, but we have them here. Um, they had crystal readings because it would not be an LA event without some crystal readings. So they had this person upstairs with like this whole setup that did these little crystal readings, style rituals is what it's called, and you pick like some crystals and then they give you a reading on it. Mine were all about um, that I'm in the process of like kind of organizing things, which is true, and then um, money that I'm like manifesting money and stuff. I mean, I'm not super into crystals, but you know, I won't diss crystals, like I know a lot of people are into them. Um, I am not super obsessed with them by any means, but that was cool to be a part of and try out. We got one of these, it's like a, oh, no! <laughs> we got one of these, which is like a USB charger thingy, it just like charges your phone really fast, I guess. We got some products, I already put like most of the makeup products in my, uh, in my closet. I get ready in my closet, but um, it's like some lip glosses from CoverGirl and some eyeliner, which actually came in handy literally two days ago. I don't have any like plain pencil liners and they gave me one and I was like, oh, I needed one today, like thank you so much. So that was awesome. Some more Bliss products, some cards from the alcohol company, some USB stuff, just like kind of random stuff. I know. Two years ago at the event, I got like an airbrush makeup set, which was really cool. 
Um, they had a lot more like makeup and hair products. They gave away free movie tickets. They had like different, um, what's the brand that makes like the cups? Turvis, maybe? Like they had those. They have a bunch of other stuff. So it's just kind of like a lot going on. They have different brands that have different clothes. They gave away like mics one year, like little clip-on mics. Um, because if you're a content creator, you usually have to have a microphone. The brand Fender one year gave away like these really cool things. I think they were like microphones or something. I'm not sure because I didn't like hang out in that area. Um, like Patron sponsors and stuff. So these are just some of the things you get at influencer events. Um, it just kind of depends like if it's a brand event, like a specific brand, you're obviously going to get a lot of stuff from that one brand. Like if it's a Becca event, like Becca Cosmetics, you're going to get all Becca products. And unless there's like another brand involved. So this one is just one of those events that has like a bunch of stuff involved. I'm trying to think. Oh, they had a donut wall, which was pretty cool, except I'm gluten free. So I could just look from afar <laughs> and not actually have anything. <laughs> they also had a pop-up roller rink. They had mochi. They had um, this one brand that has like set items. Um, so we took pictures with the real Ted um, from the movie, um, Wonder Woman sword, um, the I think it's the Wolverine thing. Um, sorry guys, I don't watch Wolverine, but you know, the like claw, something from Seinfeld. I didn't watch Seinfeld either. Um, something else. They had like some other cool stuff. So that was really fun. Um, but it's just like a nice event to network and hang out and no pressure and just relax and people are fairly nice. I hope y'all enjoyed this inside scoop into the influencer world. Typically each event is pretty different. So um, if y'all like this video, let me know and I'll make more of them when I come home from other influencer events. <laughs> Thank y'all so much for watching today's video. Be sure to subscribe down below if you enjoyed as well. I'll see y'all next time. Bye!